at the completion of his high school education at the gymnasium of his native town, 1861, he studied medicine in Berlin and Vienna. He was graduated from Berlin University in 1866, and in the same year accepted the position of private assistant to Ludwig Traub at the Cholera Hospital in Berlin, and in 1868 moved to Seehausen, near Magdeburg, where he began his career as a practicing physician. Two years later, however, he accepted the post of chief physician in a military hospital in Nordhausen, and at the close of the Franco-Prussian War returned to Berlin, where he practiced medicine, at the same time pursuing anew the studies which had been interrupted under the pressure of practical work in different hospitals. In 1881 Bajinsky was appointed Privatdozent at the University of Berlin, and in 1892 promoted to an associate professorship at that institution. He was director of the Kaiser und Kaiserin Friedrich Kinder Krankenhaus, which he founded in Berlin with the assistance of Rudolf Fierko in 1890. His services were recognized by the Prussian and foreign governments, and he received many orders and decorations. Among his other writings, besides a great number of papers scattered through several medical journals, may be mentioned, Fledge der Gesunden und Krankenkinds, The Care of Healthy and Sick Children, Stuttgart, 1885, Das Leben der Wiebs, The Life of Women, I.B. Bajinsky was a member of the several associations and committees formed in Berlin for the purpose of checking anti-Semitism in Germany. He took active part in the social and religious life of the Jewish community in Berlin, and was one of the opponents of a movement to hold Sunday services in the synagogues of that city. Bajinsky is a member of the Imperial Leopoldina Carolina Academy, commander of the Spanish Order Isabella the Catholic, and was decorated with the Prussian Order of the Red Eagle, fourth class.